right, first thing you wanna do, you wanna get all those little bits out of the bottom of your project. If you're having a hard time getting your hand inside, you can use one of the br tall brushes on the cart and just take the handle, move it around. Some of those bits might be a little stuck. And then after you're done, you're gonna take your hand, and do this a little bit more, and then jump all that stuff out. And then the next step is actually to wash your project and you're gonna wash one of these brushes, okay? So to wash the project, you are not gonna use any soap, okay? No soap on this. The soap will create defects with the glaze, so you definitely wanna make sure that you don't put soap on this. All you're gonna do is you're gonna use just clean water in the sink, doesn't matter what temperature, and you're just gonna wash it off with the clean water and just rub your hands across the, um, just over top the surface, you'll notice, and you can even see the dust on my hands, is that these are quite dusty. It's just the leftover ceramic, or the clay kind of residue, okay? So I'm gonna wash this off. You want to get the inside too. You want to wash that off pretty good because again, any of that uh, clay dust that's left on here will create defects in the glaze. It'll actually cause the glaze to crawl away from parts. So, and that's, there's nothing you can fix when that happens. And what you'll notice too, is that this dries super quick. So I don't have to wipe this off with a paper towel or anything. And sometimes you can kind of hear the water getting absorbed, but the clay is still porous. So even though it's been fired, it's still porous. But after we put the glaze on it and we get it fired again, it will no longer be porous. So that's already drying out. Then, how to wash your brushes. Before you glaze, you should always wash your brushes. Even if the brush looks clean, wash the brush. Because again, the person who used this brush before you didn't do a good job with it, and there's something else in this brush when you paint your glaze on your project, again, it could cause a defect. So the way that you wash your brushes, put some soap in the palm of your hand, take the brush, and you basically smush that brush into that soap you're not gonna hurt the brush when you do that, okay? Get that soap in those bristles and then rinse it off. And you wanna make sure you get all that soap out of that brush. So after you do that, then you're ready to glaze, okay? so. I need everybody to do this. You guys can use that sink back there also too and these two sinks here, all right? So come on up.